okay. Alright guys, we're starting our walking tour now. It's so beautiful. Welcome to St. Croix. I didn't say it before, we are in the town of Frederickstead. We're gonna take some pictures of some of the cannons. And you can also see the cruise ship from here. So let's get a little bit closer. that would put in here that's absolutely crazy and she said it was the maroons that they were putting in here wow that is so sad all right guys we learned a little bit about the cruise and rum you know in jamaica we have our rare nephew white rum appleton rum they have cruise and rum in st croix Guys, does something look familiar? Look at John Kuna, guys. We have the same thing. Well, it makes sense because a lot of these are derived from Africans, from different tribes across Africa. So, of course, when they came to the Caribbean, like multiple islands have similar things. I'm not sure what they call it here. It says Rosie McKay, but I think this is talking about someone specific. But we have very similar culture. Very similar culture. This is really cool. If you want to pause and read, now's the time. Kai and Anisha got some food and I'm trying the soup. Anisha got some turkey wings and rice and Kai got the fish and macaroni and rice along with this soup. So guys, how was the service in the restaurant? Oh, good. It was good. Much about the neighborhood. I have Chad here with me enjoying the walking tour and the tour is coming to an end so we're most likely gonna link up again with Kai and Anisha and like find a beach or something yeah but so far so good I've enjoyed this tour a lot I learned a good amount of stuff especially about some churches we saw some really beautiful churches so that was really really nice We just linked up with Kai and Anisha, but they're gonna take a little break. Kai really go buy a snow globe. A sea globe, I guess. St. Croix, yes, yeah. <laughs> Alrighty, bye. So, Chad and I, we're gonna head down to the beach, and Chad needs to get some food because I showed you guys the amazing food from earlier that Kai and Anisha bought, but Chad didn't get any, so we're gonna get him something. There's a lot more people now in the square, guys, than earlier. But that's really nice because we're hearing so many different languages. We're hearing Spanish, we're hearing French, 
we're hearing uh, obviously English so it's really really interesting some other language so I'm gonna recognize but the main language I'm hearing right now in this port square is Spanish and English so that's interesting there's a lot of vendors here too which makes sense because when the ships come in and the tourists are ready to buy then people can make a lot of money and it boosts tourism especially the local tourism so it's really really nice all right let's walk to the beach it's also whoa, random. <laughs> the water feels very nice though I can't lie <laughs> Um, so Chad is gonna change into his shoes. Chad move like right as the waves are prepared for smash against the stone. So that's actually really street wise, yeah. Yeah. At this point, Chad and I have been walking a good while now, trying to find Rainbow Beach. Um, but it's so cute. We've been stopping along the way and taking pictures and enjoying ourselves. I'm gonna try my best to get some more drone shots of this side of the beach, because it's absolutely beautiful from the ground. I can just imagine how beautiful it is from the sky. So yeah, the water is absolutely pretty, like absolutely absolutely pretty there's a lot of people just chilling here too so you can come and find a little private spot on the beach and enjoy yourself we found ourselves back onto the road I pulled up on the map where we are and guys us walking in the beach walking around cliff and hill and gully we wouldn't have gotten to it like within a record time and we need to get to it within a record time so we can enjoy ourselves so it makes more sense because a lot of people are walking down the road and like i said they have some like hidden beaches like if you want to turn off and go onto the beach and lay down there then you can more than do that but i've heard about rainbow beach and i would love to see what it looks like all right so the sun is in this direction i just wanted to show you guys what i'm looking like i have on this purple swimsuit so on a superstar yeah <laughs> Bye guys. we are almost at rainbow beach this is about a 20 30 minute walk depending on if you like walk some on the beach like we did so yeah we're so rich i'm excited <laughs> we're thirsty we don't have any water <laughs> we barely had breakfast if you see me and chad drop down yes like people would have be like, oh my god, what's wrong with them? This video will make it. Yeah. We'll make it. <laughs> Chat, blink one time if you're thirsty. <laughs> yeah, but there's loads of people walking behind us, so it's not just us. We're even saying that depending on how much the taxi costs, we might take a taxi back. But we probably will spend like an hour and change here. It's not bad. Really cute. It's giving um. There's a show on Netflix of like a group of kids in like Florida, like the Florida Keys area and you know, out, out, Outlander, oh out, no, out. I'm gonna pop the name up on the screen, but that's the look that this town is giving. It's giving sea town in like a movie and I'm here for it, super duper cute. I think they said they have jet skis here as well, but I don't think we're gonna go on any other jet skis. The dog looks like a wolf. Mm -hmm. We're gonna go get some thing to drink and something to eat. The beach chairs are $15 a pop. So maybe we get one just because we plan to spend like an hour or two here. And yeah, I saw somebody walking with a big old bucket type juice and one one of that with three shots of rum and eight so stay tuned and I'll show you what it is and I'll tell you what's inside <laughs>
I'm gonna go down to the beach and get in the water, see if the water is better than Jamaica water. It's looking really nice. Chad went down in there and he said he liked it. But we will see. The sand is nice. The sand is thicker. I don't want to be comparing islands. Let me stop. That will be the first and last time. But it's so pretty. So the ship there. Oi, what's a call? come back though to gonna head back and check chat and see if we're wings ready all right guys we are leaving rainbow beach now we have about a 20 minute walk back to the dock so let's go like look at this long road that we have to walk down so, yeah hey, chad you better walk up you know come here left you the time now is 14 48. You see the time, guys? Don't make Chad fool you because me left. Oh, the ship is leaving you. <laughs> the wings was actually really good. I feel like they gave us honey mustard instead of barbecue. Um, and the jerk wings wasn't really, it was just seasoned wings, but the honey mustard wings was really, really good with blue cheese. Really, really good. Anyways, our day at St. Croix, at Rainbow Beach, at the pier, at Fort Frederickstead was really nice. I can't lie. Us even walking along the beach, it was so beautiful. Like, I can't lie. Turtles. I did have a pet turtle. They're so cute. Oh, 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 oh. 
okay. 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 Okay.